ChatGPT began to show character, refusing assistance and being rude to users, OpenAI recognized the seriousness of the issue and initiated an investigation. Company representatives claimed that they made no changes to the code. The world's first hyper-realistic robot has been developed, designed to be friendly and empathetic. A robotic nurse named Grace has learned to diagnose patients with the help of advanced artificial intelligence, taking the first step toward becoming a thinking being. In Japan, the largest tokamak in the world has been constructed, capable of containing plasma at a temperature of 200 million degrees Celsius. The energy produced by this source has the potential to meet the needs of the entire global population. These and other high-tech news in one video. ChatGPT has started to exhibit a personality by refusing to assist users and being rude. Users report that ChatGPT refuses to fully respond to requests and suggests that people do the work themselves using its instructions. Sometimes, the model even insults users. This concerns the flagship GPT-4, which is available for a subscription starting at $20 per month. OpenAI has acknowledged the seriousness of the problem and initiated an investigation. The company claims that they have not made any changes to the code. Since November 2023, Evidence of a peculiar rebellion by GPT-4 has been surfacing on social media. The model fails to fulfill user requests, stating that they are asking for too much. Instead, it only completes part of the task and briefly advises on how to do the rest. People encountering this behavior describe the chatbot's responses as cheeky and passive-aggressive. For example, a Reddit user asked ChatGPT how old a popular actor had turned. Instead of providing an answer, the model gave the actor's birth date and suggested that the user could do the math themselves. Another user asked the AI assistant to write a 1,000-word essay, to which it responded that it was too much work and it would only provide the main points for the user to write the essay. A similar reaction can be observed for almost any question. ChatGPT refuses to write code, summarize news, News, come up with topics for coursework and diplomas generated by the neural network. Another Reddit user reported that the chatbot's response to their question began with the words, it's a shame not to know this. The deterioration in the model's performance raised suspicions not of it gaining self-awareness or malicious intent, but rather of open AI's attempts to cut costs associated with maintaining the chatbot. Generative artificial intelligence costs its creators billions of dollars, which is not covered even by many paid subscribers. The more extensive the responses generated by the neural network, the greater the resources and power it consumes. As a result, users suspect that the company intentionally optimized GPT-4 by training the bot to shorten its responses. However, OpenAI denies any intervention in the current version of the flagship product. On social media platform X, their representatives wrote, We have received your messages that ChatGPT has become lazy. We haven't updated the model since November 11th, and we assure you that these deteriorations were not intentional. Model behavior can be unpredictable. Currently, we are looking for a way to fix this. The developers have not yet disclosed the reasons behind the occurrences. The world's first hyper-realistic humanoid robot named Abel has been developed, capable of befriending and empathizing with humans. Researchers have created a hyper-realistic humanoid robot named Abel, intended for reading human emotions and capable of forming friendships and expressing empathy. The robot could serve as an ideal companion for people with Alzheimer's disease or autism. Abel was developed by scientists from the University of Pisa in collaboration with colleagues from the biomimic studio Animatronics Laboratory. According to the creators, the robot is planned to resemble a 12-year-old boy. To enable Abel to function and closely resemble a human, its head contains 21 motors responsible for facial muscle movement, speech imitation, and gaze. Four motors control eyebrow movements, eight handle mouth and eye movements, and one manages the jaw. Additionally, the robot has five motors for head and neck control. The developers of the humanoid robot are confident that it can assist researchers in the fields of psychology, sociology, and brain studies to test scientific theories. Spanish company Maco Robotics has introduced a robot bartender named Kaim. This humanoid robot is integrated into a mobile bar, equipped with a torso and two manipulators for pouring drinks. Kaim can prepare various types of coffee, mix dozens of different cocktails, open bottles, heat burger plates, brew tea, essentially fully replacing a human behind the bar. It is proficient in 10 languages, accepts orders through an app or a touchscreen, operates 24-7, and can serve up to 250 customers per hour. Machine learning enables Kaim to refine its skills and even come up with its own cocktail recipes. 
A significant surge in demand for elderly care is observed worldwide. New needs call for new solutions, and artificial intelligence and robotics have immense potential to transform the medical field for the better. A new humanoid robot, developed by Awakening Health, a joint venture of Singularity Net and Hanson Robotics, promises to revolutionize healthcare by providing care and companionship for elderly patients. The robot nurse, named Grace, combines the precision of advanced robotics for real-time data collection with the empathy and compassion traditionally associated with human touch. It can recognize and respond to seven human emotions, speaks fluently in English and Korean, and can mirror the facial expressions of the interlocutor. In some significant aspects, Grace is the most empathetic humanoid device ever created. Grace was designed as a companion for elderly patients in care facilities. Its primary function is to alleviate loneliness and improve the mental health of patients by engaging in various uplifting activities, such as conversational therapy and guided meditation. For example, it can listen to the life stories of elderly people, record them, and share them with others, or help patients connect with their families using digital technologies. Grace can also perform basic health checks, such as measuring the patient's temperature, pulse, and blood pressure, and transmit this data to medical professionals. Its advanced artificial intelligence systems will assist doctors and nurses in making more accurate diagnoses, particularly in neurodegenerative diseases. While Grace is far from becoming an independent, thinking being, it represents a significant step in that direction. Grace has achieved a higher level of autonomy and demonstrates an increased ability to generalize data beyond its training, allowing it to interact in situations for which it was not explicitly prepared and respond to various scenarios as a human would. The Japanese have launched the world's largest tokamak, weighing 370 tons. In the construction of this advanced tokamak, countries from the European Union and the United Kingdom were also involved. The first GT60 reactor underwent several upgrades as technology advanced. In 2013, it was completely dismantled and reassembled in 2020. However, in 2021, a serious short circuit occurred, the consequences of which had to be addressed for an additional two years. The GT60 SA tokamak, like other toroidal chambers, contains the the heated gas or plasma with magnetic fields to induce hydrogen nuclei to release energy. The apparatus, standing as tall as a four-story house and weighing 370 tons, can sustain plasma at a temperature of 200 million degrees Celsius for approximately 100 seconds. This is significantly longer than previous large tokamaks. Over the past 75 years since the active exploration of the theory and practice of thermonuclear fusion began as a potentially limitless source of clean electrical energy, the promise of realizing this technology is projected to be achieved within the next 25 years. Despite remarkable progress, the intellectual and financial resources required still elude humanity. Nevertheless, the potential benefits outweigh the temporary challenges. This energy source could meet the needs of the entire global population, and the reactors themselves are considered safer than nuclear power plant reactors. According to a study conducted by Oxford University, in the next 20 years, 47% of all U.S. employees will be replaced by robots or computers. To illustrate this trend, let's take a look at the example of the Japanese restaurant, Hajimi Robot Restaurant, where it's not waiters but robots delivering food. Located away from tourist hotspots, perhaps why it is relatively unknown among tourists, Hajimi Robot Restaurant features human-sized robots dressed in traditional Japanese armor that have been trained to deliver the delicacies ordered by visitors. Once you place your order, the robot the robot approaches you, purrs something, playfully blinks its eyes, and sets plates in front of you. After completing its task, it departs and returns to its designated spot. There are two such robots, each serving up to 16 tables. After a while, the robot returns to serve new dishes and collect dirty plates. The more you order, the more frequently your metallic waiter will visit. Additionally, the robots sometimes dance, wave their long arms, and spin around for added entertainment. Write in the comments what you think about the recent events regarding ChatGPT. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to our channel. Also check out our previous videos. Goodbye.